Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I am trying to hurry up and get this intro recorded before Tommy makes it home. He says he's gonna be home at 3.30 and right now it's 3.05. He's normally an early person so I wanna go ahead and get started. As y'all can tell by today's title, I'm not gonna be wearing my engagement ring to see if my fiance notices, which I think he might notice, he might not. It's a 50-50 chance, honestly, with Tommy. Like, either he will or he won't. Or he may say something like three days later and be like, hey, just so you know, you thought that I didn't know, but I do know that you didn't have your engagement ring on. Why not? I think he's gonna notice. The weird part is gonna be taking it off my finger. Like, look at that. Like, I do not take my ring off for nothing. Like, I take it off. Even when I'm supposed to take it off, I don't take it off. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. It just depends, but like, I don't want to take it off. It was just so special. It's just such an amazing time. It still makes me like super happy to think like he's my fiance. Like I look at him and I'm like, whoa, whoa, that's mine. But anyways, nonetheless, video is about me not wearing my engagement ring today. So I'm gonna take it off, which I really, really don't want to. But I'm gonna take it off and I'm probably gonna put it in some cleaner while it's off. That way it can at least be doing something cool while I'm not here with it. We're gonna be vlogging today. Like we already talked about, we need to record today. So he's gonna think normal day, vlogging, running errands, doing stuff that we have to do. But little does he know, I'm trying to see, does he realize if I have the ring on or not? Should I take it off? I don't want to take it off. I really don't want to take it off, but I am. I'm gonna take it off for y'all. So I'm take it off and see what he thinks. I keep looking outside like I'm by my window trying to see if he's gonna walk by the window and I need to like hurry up. He should be here any minute. Like I said, we'll probably pick up the vlog in the car because we have errands to run. Let's see if he notices. Tommy, you better notice. Well, I still have no flavor. You have something that's flavorless? It's kind of good though. It is. It's like water, like a hint of cucumber and mint. It's refreshing. Yeah, I kind of like it. I should have got one. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. If you haven't been to our channel before, this is my trees. Today, we're just gonna be us. It's gonna be us today. I don't really have anything planned. We're vlogging today, but we're running errands. We just went to Whole Foods. We're in the Whole Foods parking lot. Did you show them what you got? What oh, it was yeah. called? Cucumber mint Ardor. Not really know. Ardor? Yeah. Ardor? It's pretty cool packaging. Can I have one more sip again? It this is really good. Like, shockingly good. And I would know. That's kind of like a seltzer. It's like non-alcoholic seltzer. Yeah. And then this is what I got. I got Focus Aid, which I only really get this when I'm hungover. You get the purple one when you're hungover. Oh, what's the purple? Immunity Aid or something? No, it has. It's called Party Aid, I think. Mm. Or is it? Maybe not. But I know that it has like milk pills and stuff like that, so it helps cleanse your liver and do all that good stuff. Yeah, I'll, I'll get the party aid. The party aid, after you've been out partying, this one, Focus Aid, this one just tastes good. I don't know. I'll let y'all know by the end of the day. It has caffeine in it that helps you. Natural caffeine. So, look at my new nail color. Where are we going? Look at my new nail color. I like your new nail color. Where's your ring? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Where's your ring? How did you already notice that I didn't have my ring on? I saw like a fat ass print that I'm not used to seeing there. <laughs> what are you used to seeing there? Your ring? Honestly, I don't know where I put it. Okay, that's fine. Material things. You just, just know you want me to get another one. I look for it, I just, it hasn't came up. I already told you. If you lose that, you're not getting another one. Get, your, get yourself a gym bag. When did you notice what I told you about my nail color? Yeah. That's what you I automatically. I saw the print on your hand. I was like, where's your ring? Oh, you look at this. Wear your ring. Look at this print on my hand. It's like a mean print. Like, you can tell that I wear my ring. Like, I do not take my ring off. I'm obsessed with my ring. I love my ring. I love what it symbolizes. But literally, look at this. Like, that's an issue. But you end up finding it knowing you. You didn't put it anywhere that, you know, that you wouldn't be able to find it. We both had a very, very, very long 
productive day. And right now it is 444. It's 444? Yeah. Look at the clock. Did I get my cell phone? It's 444. Oh, moment. now it's 445. It's my, favorite, my favorite number. But 444 in our car. Yeah, we had a long day. So we both got like some energy, drink some pick me ups. We're thinking about getting some more accessories for the camera. My next big purchase for the, well, our next big purchase <laughs> for the camera, we, we're gonna get a new lens. Yeah, we definitely need to get a new lens. Maybe we can look at lenses today. All right, y'all. So we, <laughs> we forgot to record when we went into Urban Outfitters. Like wasn't even thinking, we actually weren't even like supposed to go to Urban Outfitters, but we were in the area, so. And I love these new bags that they give, look. That's cute, right? I can use it. Hmm. Yeah, if you, if you and Memphis, you know that Slim Pick is up here. It is well, Slim Pick. Down here. It's very slim pickings around here. But anyways, when I do see an urban, I'm like, okay, I wanna go in there. So I got this top, which I really like, super cute. I got this shirt. I love this shirt. It's really, really cute. Me and Tommy were just having like a conversation because I was like, am I in a crisis? And then I got this skirt, which I really love. So the problem is, it's like, I love the shirts, like I, I I love these shirts. The skirt, I love too, and the only problem is that sometimes I just think like, is it too cool for me? That's not what Or you am said. I cool enough? That's not like, what you am said. I old enough? No, that's not what you said either. What did I say? You said, am I too old to be wearing this? Yeah, like I- And I'm like, like girl, you are 26 and sexy. Like, what, what, is a, what else is a beautiful 26 year old supposed to wear? Like, you're, you're at the age where you're supposed to be having fun wearing whatever the hell you want without anybody judging you know what i mean that's true you should be out just, here just you know living your best life and just throwing on the fits like yeah. get wild get crazy have fun which i do i already wear stuff like this it just kind of seemed like it, i wear like the skirt shorts you, like look this, at the dress you got on now the joint hella short yeah i don't know i don't know i think i just like overthink a lot Everything and then Tommy got something too. He got some sunglasses. He has some replacement ones because I was at a fight. Ruthless. I was at a fight and um, somebody got knocked down. The you know what out. And I was jumping up and down. I got too excited and it fell out my face and it broke. But it's okay. You were jumping up and down and your glasses fell out. I was so I was so happy <laughs> to see something. It's not anything gonna mess up. I was at a cage fight and this guy was like pinned up against the cage, right? And he was like getting like knocked out. The referee was not stopping it. Like he was asleep in the corner and the guy was literally holding him up by punching him. He was he was just getting knocked out. And I was like, stop the fight, stop the fight. Cause he was gonna kill him. I don't wanna see anyone die that day. But it was, it was kinda awesome too. You're definitely living your best life so much to the point where you broke your glasses. All right, y'all, we figured we would go ahead and close out the vlog for today. And we'll see y'all in the next vlog, which will hopefully be tomorrow. We're trying to do, like, daily vlogs for y'all. If not, you know. Yeah. If not, you know, you'll see us this week. Yeah, exactly. Weekly vlogs, for sure. So. Artif you know, none of that artificial stuff, right? No. All organic. All organic so we're trying our best like we we had already told y'all like we want everything on our channel to be super unique to us so yeah or just super us in general yeah no 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 weird behaviors guys make sure you like this video subscribe to the channel and we'll see you in the next vlog bye, bye. <laughs> hold, on, hold on go back up i got you well we went to fire It's really good. I'm digging in already. What is it called? It's cheap. Sun and Shade, but we replaced the Alfredo with um, pesto. Oh, bro, this is hot. How are you eating this? You are savage. Mm. Savage, baby. That's what you are. Y'all eat y'all food hot and y'all shower, but how are y'all able to take a shower in such heat? I turn on the heat just a little bit and I'm just like, ah! I feel like my skin's burning off. You got it on full heat. How are you able to, like how are women, I heard that's like a common thing with like women. You guys are able to shower in very extreme heat. 
Now, I've seen you jump in a jacuzzi and not even work your way in. You just <laughs> cannonball. Because we got no wusses. Oh, that's what it is. So men are just wusses. Well, you know, you guys do have to have a higher pain tolerance than most men because you do. You guys do have to bear children, so that makes sense. Yeah, you're just not a wuss. I mean, you're, I guess so. I guess men are just wussies. We just do what we gotta do. It's really not that hot once you start eating it, baby. 